My name is Derek Perez and I'm a filmmaker based here in Tampa, Florida. I spent eight years of my life in the Florida foster care system. Growing up in foster care isn't easy, being separated from your family and everything you've ever known. But God's been my foundation. It wasn't until recently where I learned that in those dark times of you know going through the crazy things that I had to go through and um, feeling all alone and ashamed, uh, God was with me, just as he is with me in this room recording this video to send to you. I've been making movies for the past 13 years. Uh, I was selling out my first movie theater at age 14 at the AMC over here in Brandon, Florida. And um, I have such a passion for filmmaking. I love making movies. I direct, I produce, I write, I even act. And I have this really big project that I definitely wanted to bring to your attention called Uproar. It's a young man growing up in foster care. He's got siblings in foster care. He's a separated sibling like I was a separated sibling. And um, he's just trying to navigate his way through life. He's getting ready to age out, but he wants to be a boxer. He wants to be something. I believe this story is not only going to really shed light on what goes on in the foster care system and, of course, the many stories that are there within that very system, but I believe ultimately this is going to help people that have experienced trauma really get a voice and really also learn ways to navigate their way through their trauma to healing, to being something, to following that purpose that God has set before them. I have spoke now on a plethora of platforms just to really push the need to really support foster youth. But I think there's a huge story here. I believe God's pushing me to use my voice on an even bigger platform now through film and television, which is why I created this series. And I don't think that this specific story has been done before. I don't think people know what night to night is. I don't think people understand that kids are sleeping in cars. I don't think people understand the realities of what some of these teenagers and kids go through on an everyday basis. I have 400 pages of an amazing eight episode epic for a first season for this show called Uproar. And we're currently looking for financing to get this project made and picked up and distributed. As a film director, I'm excited to be able to use my voice and my gifts to be the voice of others. I'd love to be able to do this with you. But will you be back? You always come back. Just don't take so long this time, please. I'm not coming back this time, God. But that don't mean I don't love you. 